Just when all seemed to be lost, a glimpse of hope for embattled retailer Sears. KPIX 5's Ann Makovic reports the company is in a last ditch effort to keep from having to shut all its stores, at least for now. There are about 500 Sears stores still operating across the U.S., including this one here at the Tampa Rand Shopping Center. But it looks like most, if not all, of them could be closing in a matter of months. I've always shopped here, but all my appliances here. Sears customers are mourning the decline of what was once an iconic American retailer. Anything I need, I would just to come, but well, you see, I won't come anymore if this close. Parent company Sears Holdings, which filed for bankruptcy in October, is now considering a revised bid from the hedge fund run by its chairman and former CEO. It could keep 425 Sears stores open, but Sears has to accept that $4.4 billion bid, which is now part of an auction running through January 14th. Sears has suffered from declining mall traffic and a failure to generate enough online sales, which some of its loyal customers reject. The shipping is problematic, you know. A lot of people are still in packages, whether they know what's inside or not. Sears' last profitable year was 2010, and it has lost $12 billion since then. It used to be a nice mall, so I don't know what's going to happen. Right now, Sears employs about 50,000 people. They've been in business for 126 years. In San Bruno, Ann Makovic, KPIX5.